good. Not good. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Over the barrel bomb. Oh, yeah. No, it walks no. kind of funny. Uh, <laughs> I, I think I know that girl. <laughs> I don't know if the term lady in waiting really applies to her, though. Huh? <laughs> uh, oh, Angus. Well, it appears that ale and the ocean are adverse to his sea legs. Don't feel so well. Well, let's get him up. <clears throat> Come on, lad. Let's get you below. Uh, hey, oh, nice guitar. Like that. Well, that is a nice guitar. I say, Pete. Dear Angus doesn't look as if he'll be up to playing any time soon now, does he? But, wait, but, oh, uh, no. But, uh, He's more tailed in his kilt. I think someone should take pity on the poor gentleman and keep this guitar safe. Absolutely. And, of course, the only way to ensure that the musical instrument stays in optimum condition is to play it a lot. I was just going to say. In fact, I hear that Merlin has all sorts of engagements lined up for the boys once we arrive. And poor Angus couldn't possibly be up for a strenuous bit of performing. Well, I think not. He'll be down for eight months even. And if one were to have this guitar in safekeeping... If one were to have this guitar in safekeeping, say, you, Captain Nash... Or you, Wicked Pete... One would feel inclined to sit in every now and then... Aye, every now and then. Of course, it would only be temporary. Oh, yes, yes, only temporary. Well, we can switch off. An excellent idea. In fact, I've got this concept for guitar for four hands that I've been dying to try out. You don't say... Come along, Angus. We'd like to hear what a real Scotsman sounds like. Whatever happens, those lads will never replace me. <laughs> <laughs>